As the war in Ukraine continues to press on, more and more U.S. troops are heading to help in Europe. 25 News reporter Adam Schindler is on post tonight. The U.S. Army is full of tradition and ceremony, but some ceremonies carry a heavy load, like the casing of unit colors, packing up the unit flags, like the 2nd Brigade Combat Team with the 1st Cavalry Division just did, because they are deploying. Our colors are, are near and dear to us. It's, a, it's the kind of the, the physical manifestation of who we are as a unit. Uh, represents our past, our present, and is a hope for our future. Uh, so casing those colors here is a symbol of us departing the great place here at Fort Hood and moving ourselves and the entire organization forward to conduct operations in Europe. The 2nd Brigade Combat Team is known as Blackjack Brigade. And Blackjack is headed to Europe as one of the most lethal armored brigades the Army has to offer. While over 3,000 Blackjack soldiers leave to assist NATO allies, one unit is staying back on an equally important mission. So 49 Cav, commanded by Nick James, is our home station mission command. So he's back here, uh, enabled with several key, key personnel uh, to make sure he can take care of soldiers who aren't going forward and also to uh, take care of our families uh, who are remaining behind. Family members like Mandy Stanley, a wife who is saying goodbye to her husband, Captain Bob Stanley, a chaplain with Blackjack Brigade. It's obviously a, a thing that will make you nervous, and um, but knowing that he's doing what he's trained to do and knowing that he loves what he does, I just have to trust that he will be okay and that all the soldiers will do the jobs that they need to do. A job those soldiers say they and their vehicles are more than ready for. I can speak to the credibility of the vehicles because I helped make sure that all the vehicles that we're sending overseas are up to standard. Blackjack Brigade has officially cased their colors and now head out to deter possible enemies and assist NATO allies in Europe. On Fort Hood, Adam Schindler, 25 News.